This guy moved into a kennel to be with a dog who was alone for 400 days. Meet Queen. She's adorable and friendly, but she's also spent over 400 days in the Great Plains SPCA Animal Shelter. Before we begin, make sure to smash that like button, subscribe to our channel, and click the notification bell for more amazing videos. After over a year in the shelter, Queen had started to lose hope of ever being adopted, until a hero stepped up with an unlikely plan to find her forever home. Scott Poor left corporate America behind to focus on his true passion, improving the lives of dogs around the country. Poor runs Mission Driven Goods, an organization that runs fundraisers for animal shelters. Poor practices what he preaches and visits shelters on a daily basis to spend time with animals. He even reads books to dogs in the hopes of helping to keep their spirits up. After visiting Queen every single day for over a year, Poor decided that enough was enough. He could tell that his friend was becoming depressed, and he wanted to do whatever he could to help her find a new family. Poor hatched a daring plan. If Queen wasn't going to a home anytime soon, then a home could come to Queen. Poor decided to move into the animal shelter. While unorthodox, this move made a lot of sense. Firstly, Queen could get the additional companionship that she desperately needed for her mental health. Secondly, this would generate publicity on her behalf, letting prospective owners know that she needed a home. In a coy video on Instagram, Poor can be seen wheeling his suitcase into the animal shelter. He didn't bring a lot with him, hoping that he wouldn't have to stay for more than a few days. In a subsequent video, Poor made the announcement, he was going to stay by Queen's side, until they could find her a forever home. Immediately, the local press sat up and paid attention. The first day after Poor's announcement was filled with interviews and filming, as he did everything he could to bring attention to Queen's situation. It was exhausting, but everyone was hopeful that it would help raise awareness of the shelter. After a full day of engaging with a media circus, Poor and Queen went to bed on the floor of Queen's room, cuddled up in each other's arms. The night was not exactly a comfortable experience for Poor. After spending a few days in the shelter, Poor and Queen had a few good leads on a new home. Alas, nothing concrete was forthcoming, which meant that Poor would need to remain on the floor of the shelter for a little longer. Poor continued to give updates on his experience on Instagram. Many viewers from around the world were eagerly following the story to see what would happen. Everyone was rooting for Queen to get adopted. Poor did his best to spruce up Queen's room. He brought in a pot plant, a photo frame, and even the largest doggy bed he could buy. It was, sadly, still not quite big enough for a human. One day, to alleviate their boredom and frustration, Poor snuck Queen out of the shelter and into his car. Together, they went to get ice cream, although Poor insists that Queen wasn't allowed to finish the whole thing by herself.